Good morning, Frank Watkins, 7th of Feb, and in the company of Kylie. Good morning, everybody. Uh, just quick comment on the all odds. This resistance level here seems to be holding firm at the moment, very close to 7420. The reason for drawing that line is if I go back to these a couple of days back here, uh, we had a high of 7.4.19 and the next, whoops, the next day again, um, uh, the next day again, high of 7.4.19 and we go through a, a couple of levels here fairly close. One way or another, let's, let's say um, uh, 7.4 to 7.4.50 is going to be a bit difficult to get through. Uh, backing off a bit today, uh, not surprising, Dow down 20, so surprised we're not down about 120. So uh, hanging on pretty strong. I hope you detect the customary car sarcasm. Okay, uh, my high, 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 low scan, what I'm going to try and do today also is tell you why I'm going to avoid stocks. Uh, I'm always looking for a reason not trade a stock so to convince me to get in and put my money on the line it's got to be pretty good um, if not just the perfect setup so this one here uh, my eyes just go straight to this big round three cent level wouldn't go near it uh, sorry four cent level wouldn't go near it until it breaks through uh, 379 million out there uh, that's good advanced braking technology don't know that, that does much for me but um, it's a weight anyway um, not interested in this as a higher 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 low setup because the low is not uh, significant enough and long enough not saying it won't buy, won't break out not saying a break of seven dollars wouldn't be important but as a higher 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 low not interested uh, immediately I just see these dot days and just move on and there's the reason 2.42 billion out there has to be the same uh, 4.6 billion not interested happy valley nutrition oh isn't that sweet um, there is bottoming action there I guess consumer staples 12 million out there um, there's nothing overly stimulating about that except a bit of bottoming action could be good for a run towards seven and a half but um, not a lot of volume done hasn't traded since the third of Feb and even then only 60 million went through so uh, I'd say that's probably in a trading halt or no one is interested uh, IVZ again the work this has done across the 15 cent level, that is a huge stopper. Uh, I've also always said buying 13 and a half as a price level just does not interest me because you know that there's going to be a resistance at the big number of 15. Uh, this is similar. Okay, we've got a long term low here, but um, going to have to do a lot of work to get through the two cent level and not a lot of volume done so again i'd be pretty careful of that and again it hasn't traded today monash this is not coming off a um long-term significant low again not saying it won't go higher and it won't break out but it's not a higher high high low setup obv looks good we have really just come back to this level here Tested support at around 90 cents and then continued upwards. NML, uh, similar issues, going to have troubles getting through 10 cents. OBV, okay. Uh, one to keep an eye on, but I wouldn't get too excited right at the moment. Orica, um, for me, there's probably too much distance between this low of around 11.50 to uh, 15 50 16 dollars I'd, I'd rather see a, a gradual low rather than this 
again, I'm, I'm being a bit nitpicky, but that's the name of the game. Super resources, you can see the resistance at six cents. TDO again, gappy, not enough volume there. Um, 3D oil, right industry at the moment. Uh, TTM, big issues at 13 cents. We're a long way away from that at the moment at 10 and a half. Very good OBV. Uh, again, not a lot of volume being done. Um, I'd probably wait for better. In that scan today, there is no better, so be patient, move on. Move and on. Pass over to Kylie. Thank you. Now, just quickly, some uh, one of our listeners did ask about why we look at the issued. Um, shares on issue and we don't take buy over a certain amount basically it doesn't mean you, you can't we just look for reasons not to buy a stock and if you've got too many out there i liken <coughs> it to a piece of, like if you've got a whole cake would you rather share cake with 10 people frank or 100 oh let me think oh, that involves God. maths doesn't it mm. <laughs> Um, I know, I love cake. If you cut cake. it into 100, pe 100 pieces, it'd go further, more people. Well, you'd have more people. You'd get less cake, though. So oh. if you're on a diet, it works. But if you like, I like cake, so I'd rather not share it. <laughs> so if you've got more shares on issue, you're sharing with a lot more people. Anyway, food for thought. I like cake. <laughs> Jeez, I hope there's a cake company that's publicly listed. Yeah. We could have some fun. <laughs> <laughs> I think we've got morning tea coming today. So now today... I thought I'd do something a bit different. And um, if some of you may know this, some of you don't, there is a function in the scanning tools where you can scan for anything that's crossed a trend line that you've drawn onto your screen. So I thought we'd try this today, and this is going to be really risky because I don't know what trend lines Frank's drawn. I think he's drawn a lot. The more you have, the better. The reason I'm wanting to do a trend line crossing today um, is there's not much coming up in the scans and it's time to just see what's crossing any trend lines that have been drawn on your screen. You mean you just want to check, Franks? I do. I just want to see if you've done any work or not. Okay. Um, and you've got some homework. If you guys want to, do the same for you. Start drawing some lines and start doing this scan. Um, I'm leaving it at four days, trend line crossing the last four days. Um, again, the market that it is, if anything has crossed, it's been there for a while, so it may just be a good opportunity to, uh, yeah, to see if there's an entry and scan. And go, oh, here we go. Ah, yes. We might have to chop it off there because we have had internet issues and they're NBN and there's whole stack of people digging a hole out on the road. There are. Okay, we have connected again. Let's, uh, let's see, see how, we, how go. we go. There's a few, Frank. You have been busy. Oh, I've got bloody lines. You've been busy. <laughs> we'll just... Not look at that and just have a look at it. Let's have a look. All right, so we've got 52 at least. Now, bear in mind that the trend line will cross from anywhere ago um it will be could be off the screen actually that's a, a really good example um of how the software actually works the trend yeah. line is back there at 12 cents yeah it's down yeah. here i think it's looking at this one here you've got a little line oh, yeah, there yeah, yeah. so yeah. um yeah. this one looks like it's way off so we'll just move on i don't know if that's any there's only two, two stats, two, two dollars has gone through that today. We'll move on. Here we go. There's a line there, and it's crossed above that. Move on though. It's crossed above. That one was a. That's. I think that's in a takeover bid, which yeah. we're not worrying about. So. Some food for thought. It just shows that some of my trend lines are very old. Yeah, that's, that's, that's a good one. Yeah. yeah, there's 40 cents, had a crack. 
I'd like to see that move sideways a little bit more. But that's not bad. What is that? BCI 1.2. Not too bad. Oh, now that just looks amazing. I'm liking how BHP are what's happening there. The little pattern that's going to form. Oh goodness, that's a blast from the past. Interesting. Not sure about that one. Lots of trend lines here. Not really doing much though. So anyway, a bit of education today. We're not going to go through 50, but just if you didn't know that existed, draw trend lines and do a trend line crossing scan. See what you come up with. That's me for today. Okay, very good. All right. We shall attempt the same tomorrow with a difference. Yeah, have a good day.